Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to a new Jump Force video. And yes, guys, it is finally here. It has finally been announced after a month of not hearing anything and it just taunting our faces. As you can see, February 12th, we finally get our online tournament battle. Now this is starting on March 11th for me in my time zone, Pacific Standard Time for the rest of you, uh, March 12th. Now, as you can see, the rewards, it's a little, well, actually, let's go over the date. First off, this only lasts a week. Okay, that's important. It's a very short one. It's kind of like what they did with Vertex. Vertex only lasted a week. They're going to see how well we like this, and then they're going to make it a thing. I'm assuming after this week, they might do a rate of battle, uh, Vertex, and then bring back online battle or online tournament mode, right? It's kind of like a just cycle of these events, which I am glad they're doing, but, you know, skip Vertex. No one really cares about Vertex. As you can see, for the rewards, if you're top one to a thousand, you get useless stuff, useless stuff, useless stuff, but the championship rewards. Now, this is not the same thing as just the regular tournament modes. What's going to happen is the regular tournament mode is just going to be back to back battles with random opponents. Okay, as you can see, uh, join a tournament battle by selecting three characters and earn event points by defeating other players in back to back battles. Okay. Uh, players win with streaks in tournament battle uh, get bonus points. So if you win five in a row, I'm assuming you get streaks and streaks and you just get more points the more you win, right? Um, stack up those wins to earn more points. Event points uh, earned increase with the selected difficulty. Um, so I'm assuming it's like a uh, arena battle where you have those four difficulties um, and then but when you win more, you can go like into the master class. I think that's what it's called. I'm forgetting. So let's just pretend master class was the last one. And if you're fighting master class, you get more points, right? Now here is the weird part. On the last day of the tournament battle, players who have earned above a set number of points will unlock the championship, win the championship, and become the strongest player out there. So just kind of like vertex you know how vertex has this thing on the leaderboards where it tells you if you're part of a clan if you're going to d rank or rank based on these set points you have i believe that's how it's going to tell you what it is so basically what you need to do is play this online tournament battle until you get let's say it's a thousand points it's not it's probably going to be more but let's say it's a thousand points play until you get a thousand points and then as a character as a player why is my outro playing again what the heck um, as a player, you unlock this championship um, game mode. I'm not sure what it's going to be. I hope it's not just going to be on the last day only for 24 hours. Although that would be a very like smart but also kind of annoying thing to do. Um, so what's going to happen is you unlock this game mode and then you play it with the other players who have also unlocked this game mode. And then you play to win. Now, I'm not sure how they're going to do that. The championship maybe could be our first time where we spectate other players fighting each other, maybe? Or maybe you just have to beat one opponent. Maybe you guys get in a group of eight people and you play each other and you spectate each other, which I don't think is going to happen at all, but that'd be really cool. I'd be happy for that. And if you win the championship rewards, you get Satan costume, you get the ruler on the first tournament, uh, ruler of the first tournament, and the emotion on the champ, okay? That is the basis of what is happening with this event. Now, the major thing here is to remember to get above that set number of points. I do not know what that set number of points are or is. So just grind out this tournament so you have a chance at least in participating in the championship game mode. So I will warn you guys because this is quote tournament it's going to be filled with people that are going to be very desperate for wins. So expect guard break cheese, R3 is just people like dark end. I'm not sure if CACs can be part of this. We will see. I'm assuming they will be. I mean, if they're part of the rank still, they're probably going to be a part of this. So be very careful. Expect a lot of stuff like that. But other than that, guys, I'm super pumped. Um, mainly for the championship part about this. Uh, the other part just kind of sounds... Like, it's just arena battle, right? But you get to choose your three characters that you're playing. And there's no kind of, like, uh, buffs and debuffs that you can use. Uh, so, yeah. Remember, this is only lasting for about a week. So make sure you grind out those points. And make sure you're there for the last day. Let me see if I made that right, though. Uh, on the last day of tournament battle. Yeah, so make sure you're on that on Jump Force on that last day of the tournament battle. So that'll be weird. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys later.